Watch yourselves. Bring it closer. Closer. Varro, I take it? <laughs> Aloy. The outcast who won the proving. So you survived your wounds. High Matriarch Tirsa said you might know the way to Meridian. The capital of the Karja Sundom? You seek exile? No. A traitor named Olin. The Matriarchs made me a seeker so I could go after him. Huh. Well, then you should head north to Mother's Crown. If you make it, talk to Morea. She'll point the way. If I make it? The trail is dangerous. Ever since the War Party Massacre, our lands go unpatrolled and our borders unguarded. We have no war chief to lead us. Isn't that Resh's job? Ugh. Only because Sona went missing. Now, I'd go after her myself, but she ordered me to hold this gate with my life. And so I have. You said the trail is dangerous. What sorts of dangers? <laughs> Almost too many to name. The killers are still out there, and somehow they've corrupted the machines, spreading madness. Yes, I've seen it myself. Bandits, too. Cutthroats who snuck across the border to prey on us. The word is, there's a camp in the metal ruins upriver. Sounds like I need to craft more arrows. You said I won the Proving. How did you know that? I spoke to survivors. They said you fought bravely, as did Bast. And my sister. Your sister was Vala? I'm... I'm very sorry. I, I liked her. I think we might have even become friends. If we'd had a chance. Thank you. She died saving others. There is no better death. You said the war party was massacred. How? <sighs> when word came of the attack on the Proving, War Chief Sona assembled a war party to give chase. But in their haste to get vengeance, some braves broke rank and raced ahead, straight into a trap. A pack of crazed machines, seething with corruption, fell upon the braves and savaged them. War Chief Sona led a countercharge and destroyed the machines, but by then the killers were gone, and our losses were extreme. You said War Chief Sona is missing? Even when the war party was massacred, she wouldn't give up the chase. She called for volunteers and went after the killers. You didn't volunteer? Of course I did, but Sona denied me that. She ordered me to see the wounded back to the embrace. And to guard this gate, to guard the embrace with my life. That was days ago, and since then there's been no word from her. So there's no way to know if she's alive or dead? If anyone could survive out there, it would be her. Sona's prowess is legend. An unbending spear to measure ourselves against. Sounds like she sets a high standard. Oh, you have no idea. She's my mother. I should be on my way. Aloy, before you make the journey to Mother's Crown and beyond, is there any chance you could search for Sona? The tribe needs her leadership. I'd go after her myself if she hadn't commanded me to hold this gate at all costs. Where was she last seen? The War Party Massacre site. A wooded hollow across from Devil's Thirst, on this side of the river. You might be able to pick up her trail there. She went after the killers who attacked the Proving, who killed those we love, who tried to kill you, and... I... I get it, Varl. I'll see what I can do. A Strider! Uh, no, no, don't attack. It's... with me. How is that possible? It's hard to explain. It's something I... discovered. I see.
May the goddess protect. My whole life, all of it in the embrace. The world just got bigger, but also more dangerous. Hunter, were you injured when the war party was ambushed? Oh, not exactly. Then I'm not a hunter, or a brave, or anything really. You shouldn't even be talking to me. Well, whoever you are, you're hurt. What happened? My name's Kren. I thought I'd have a go at the trials at the hunting grounds over the rise, you know, told my skills. It, uh, it didn't go very well. You got injured at a hunting grounds? How? Well, I was aiming for a canister on the back of a grazer, and my bowstring snapped, and I tripped, and... Uh, forget it. it. It wasn't pretty, okay? I just wanted to train a bit. Hunting grounds are perfect for that. They offer trials, which are like challenges, and they give you marks if you accomplish objectives or beat certain times. The keep is up there on the hill, just to the north. Talk to him to do a trial. I'm sure you'd be better than I did. Why did you say you weren't anything at all, and that I shouldn't talk to you? I stole a bow, okay? And got cast out. This was before the proving, so now I can't even fight for my tribe in its time of need. I have to live in the wild by myself, which is why I wanted some training. Honestly, I'm just glad the keeper would talk to me. I think he might be in exile or something. He doesn't seem to care about the laws of the matriarchs. Things aren't exactly going your way, are they? Is there anything I can do to help? No, no, I'll be all right. My father always said, all mother had a plan for me. Before he got run over by a strider anyway. I need to get going, Kren. All right, be careful, especially if you're heading north. Be sure to hit the hunting grounds if you want to train up. I spoke to Kren. He told me this is a hunting grounds where you offer tests of skill. Poor Kren. Not the best hunter. But at least he keeps his chin up. Hmm. You bear the mark of a seeker. I've heard of those, but never seen one. You have the Matriarch's leave to come and go as you like from the sacred land? Yes, but I would have gone even without their permission. Is that so? Then maybe you and I can speak plainly. Truth is, I've had dealings with the Karja. I represent an organization called the Hunter's Lodge in Meridian. We test promising young hunters with trials at places like these. You might be just the kind of person we're looking for. Why don't you sample the trials and see? Just to be clear though, I'd appreciate it if you kept our conversation in confidence, especially when it comes to the matriarchs. What is the Hunter's Lodge? It's a group of hunters who compete to bring down the mightiest machines in the land, run by the Karja in Meridian. You can see it yourself if you win three half-sons from the hunting grounds. Just to warn you though, they're not fond of Nora. Tell me about the trials. The Hunter's Lodge hosts hunting ground trials throughout the world, each offering hunters a chance to test their skills. What do I get for completing them? Pride and accomplishment, as well as marks, depending on how well you fare. Here, we offer the tools trials. What kind of tools? Hunting isn't just about your bow. It's about using everything available to you, even your surroundings. You'll see once you start taking the trials. You're not supposed to be here, are you? No, 
my friend and I left the sacred land and returned. The matriarchs wouldn't approve, to say the least. We're hunters at heart. Left because we wanted to find new herds and new machines. That's why the Hunter's Lodge appealed to us. But the Karja wouldn't have us if they knew we were Nora, so we wore Karja clothes when we brought our marks to them. After a while, it felt like we were caught between worlds. Not quite Karja, not quite Nora. We started to miss home. So we came back and set up our own hunting grounds. You think it'll work? Staying here without the Matriarch's permission? I'm not sure. But we don't believe in their rules. There's a big world out there, and ignoring it doesn't help anyone. Choose your trial, and I'll tell you how it works. Test your skill with bow and arrow by shooting parts off the backs of grazers as quickly as possible. Perfect. I'll start timing when you start down a rope. and you win a blazing sun. You're good, even for Nora. Time for me to head out. I'll be here when you're ready to test yourself. There's danger ahead, girl. Danger for you, Outlander. This is Noraland. Yes, yes, yes. Trespass is forbidden on pain of death. Strange phrase, the pain of death. See? This one's in no pain at all. Who was he? A thief, slaver, a killer. The kind that give honest killers a bad name. Fraal told me there would be bandit ambushes on the road. Well, it's not all good news. They don't always come to you. Most dig out a camp, and there they'll sit like spoil on meat. Unless... someone does something about it? I like you. Follow the trail of smoke on the other side of the ruins. I'll be there.
continues along its path and sends what it sees to other machines. Maybe the war chief left something behind. Some clue as to where she went. Lots of machines. All controlled by the killers. And Nora managed to take down a corruptor. But not before the killers used it to send the other machines against them. They sent a stampede of them down the slope. Brave, let us speak. The dead and wounded all cleared away. Are there no more braves or healers here? Just me. You're hurt. What happened? Well, I didn't. It's madness out there. War Chief Sona sent me back to report. I'm no good to her like this. Varl told me that the War Chief tracked the killers. Did she find them? We followed their trail, but again and again they sent corrupted machines to attack us. My wounds started to slow me down, so the War Chief sent me back to let others know she hasn't given up the fight. So, you were here when the war party was ambushed? I was. I thought after the proving there could be no darker day, but I was wrong. The War Chief was delayed gathering the rear guard. Eager for revenge, the Braves in the lead fell into the trap. Dozens lost in minutes. If Sona hadn't arrived and rallied us, no one would have survived. Varl sent me to look for Sona. Do you know where she is now? All I can tell you is where we parted. Near the Metal Tower, southeast of the ruins at Devil's Thirst. Look to the rise behind it with a lone boulder. I'll head for the Embrace and report what I know to Varl and the others. May All Mother lend you strength. You'll need it, going alone. This must be the rise Sona's mother told me about. The war chief stopped here. So where did she go next? That old bow has seen a lot of action. No one would have left it willingly. Someone has taken losses. They must have taken a moment to rest. Couldn't have been easy going on after the ambush. Arrow shards. Braves were crafting ammunition here. Dressings for wounds. The runner wasn't the only one who got hurt. Might be a blood trail I could follow. I should try my focus. Rich.
that sawtooth. Maybe Sona took it out. She could be close. You're lucky I happened by. One heartbeat more, and that sawtooth would have torn you apart. Half a heartbeat more, and I would have killed it myself. Uh, so you're War Chief Sona? Varl asked me to find you. Has he held the gate? He has, bravely. I saw him kill a corrupted machine himself. But he worries for you. Our tribe needs strength, not sentiment. I've tracked some of the killers who struck the Proving. I crave vengeance. Do you? You have no idea. Show me then. Lend me your strength. Follow. The killers are just across this ridge, digging the cursed earth. The sin of the ancients is buried in that soil. Corrupter demons. I know of them. I killed one at Mother's Watch. A bold claim. I wonder if you'll live up to it. Hours ago, I sent braves into hiding in the trees below. On my signal, they'll attack. The enemy and their demonic machines outnumber us. But we will have fury on our side. We could have more than that. Explain. That's Blaze. What we used to burn, they used to blast. It's how they dug out this pit. So we put fire to it and then? Boom. Then let us begin. Whoa, wait. Let's not rush. Give me some time to make an approach. If I end up alerting them, open fire. All right. Let's see what you can do.
This wasn't all the killers. I counted more at the War Party Massacre. If I have to chase their filthy shadows from here to Spear's Reach, I will. You're hurt. Losing blood. My health is not your concern. No one doubts your determination, but you need rest. She's right, War Chief. Give your wounds time to close. Val! What are you doing here? I ordered you to hold that gate with your life! And so I did, until the runner you sent returned with news of his encounter with Aloy and your location. I left the gate well guarded. My place is here, with you, with our vengeance. Am I not owed that? Uh, maybe I should have a look around, see if I can figure out where the rest of the killers are. Do as you wish. Everyone else does. Mother... Commanders, over the past month, accidental blaze explosions have killed a dozen men. Here in the Ring of Metal, I've taken the precaution of placing our entire stockpile in a covered shelter. Safe from stray sparks and lightning. And I've posted guards to control access. I urge you to take similar measures. Or suffer the consequences. Supply Master Thran, out. <sighs> a blaze stockpile inside their base. Sabotage that, and we win. I found something. The rest of the killers are camped inside a ring of metal. Any idea what that means? Damn them. The ring of metal lies in the ruins of Devil's Grief. That ground is taboo. I will return to the Matriarchs. Beg them to make an exception. There's no time for that. Blood spilled calls for blood spilled. If the ground is cursed, then let our vengeance sanctify it. You blaspheme. Please, War Chief, break the taboo. Devil's Grief is a cursed place. But maybe Aloy's secret blessing can protect us. I'll send scouts ahead. Our force will assemble at the cliff above Red Echoes and launch our attack from there. Sounds like a plan. See you there. Aloy. Thank you. You might take that back when you see what I'm getting us into. You're glad. Why? Call it a shared interest. And call me Nil. Look there, those old rocks. A bandit clan squats on them. Disturb the rocks and they'll come wiggling out. Worms that they are. Bandits. Why have they come here? The Nora are in trouble. And rumors spread like blood. With no braves to guard the border, killers hungry for sport slip right through. My partner and I shadowed these scum for days. Good tracker, but he went on ahead without me. We talked about this kind of behavior. Still, I understand. Leave it too long, your fingers itch for the bowstring. Say, how about you and I work together? Kill them all. I don't know you, and I have no reason to trust you. Trust is a rare act to find, isn't it? I'm just a traveler, with a bow, concern about the state of these lands, and a missing partner. I don't think you're just anything at all. Hmm. Let me put it another way. Are you a bandit? <laughs> of course not. Then you have nothing to fear. Alright. Someone has to stop them from hurting others. 
And we will. We'll stop them from doing anything. Safe screen, my boy. You go ahead and take the lead. I look forward to seeing what you're capable of. That's the alarm. Let them sound it and more will come with them. It's a gift. And if you're the heroic kind who needs a little extra, there's the captives. and its captives. I'm not here. Wait, who went down? Those strung up machine parts. An alarm signal. I think they're here. Oh. Seeker, may I speak with you? I'm honored. I... All Mother be praised. Are you alright? Is there something you need? Yes. My friends and I watched you clear the bandits out of this camp. We're glad. They would steal from us. Chase us through the night laughing. We're outcasts, not braves. Almost defenseless. Where did you all come from? Some of us have wandered the sacred lands for years. As for me, the village I grew up in was burned in the Red Raids. I'm ashamed I wasn't there to protect them, but I was an outcast long before the Karja came. How did you come to be an outcast? I was a fool. I refused to do what I was told. Never went hunting when I could sit under a tree instead. I argued with my family every step, picked fights with other braves. One day, such a fight grew fierce. I got a lucky hit, an unlucky one. He went down, and there was no one left to speak for me. I deserve to be an outcast. You seem different from the person you describe. I hope to be. How did you all come to be here together? You wonder how we speak to each other when the law forbids it. But what hope do we have here, outside the embrace, alone? I wasn't judging you. I was an outcast once. Forgive me. You're right to ask. I convinced them to speak. I told them we were only sentenced to be outcast, not to die out here. An intelligent approach. We are all outcasts, but we need to stay together to survive. This camp we once hated could serve us well now. Would you let us stay here, even if it flies in the face of the Matriarch's laws? Of course, by all means. Oh, I'd hoped you'd say so. You... you're an inspiration to us. 
thank you. Feels good, doesn't it? Hold it inside you one last breath, then let it out. Ugh, I didn't find your partner. They killed him. I hardly feel surprised he was already getting cocky when we carved through the last bandit camp. I thought he and I were agreed, only enjoy the killing as much as the challenge. No great loss, nothing in the wilds I can't handle, just me and the voice of our teeth here. Your bow has a name? Yours doesn't. You're not just a traveler. That armor was fitted for you, and the way you hold your bow. I said a concerned traveler. And I was a soldier, but I was a soldier longer than there was a war, if you follow. Where the arrowhead passes between armor and skin, that's the place I belong. So I make opportunities to find it. It's like coming home. Have you ever thought about hunting machines? Oh, they don't get that look in their eyes. Did bandits wrong you somehow? They wrong us all. They live filthy lives, so they have to die that way too. So you hunt them down to help others? No, no. For sport. I can't wait for wars anymore. Life's too short and the thrill of death too sharp. If you kill a tribesman, there'll be retribution. Hunt a boar, they complain if you waste the meat. But bandits, they're vicious. They always put up a fight, and no one cares if you kill them. I'm not sure who's worse, you or them. We're standing, they're not. Clearly, we were better. We're done here. Here? I'm afraid so. But we live in a world of ruins, and bandits are drawn to them like infection to a wound. You wouldn't let that infection set in, would you? I'm sure we'll meet again. Maybe. If it can't be helped. If we pass each other by, we'll know it by her.